The Honda Elevate isn't just another face in the crowded compact SUV market. Although it receives stiff competition from the South Koreans, the Europeans and even the Japs, the Elevate is setting new benchmarks. Not just with its robust sales, but also with its no-nonsense approach. This approach helped Elevate bag the compact SUV title at the 2024 totems. So, if you're considering buying this latest from Honda, then this video is for you. Honda's attention to detail shines through, even in the Elevate's base SV variant. Packed with essentials, the Elevate SV offers front and rear power windows, powered side mirrors and keyless entry with push-button start-stop. Add to this a tilt and telescopic steering wheel, LED projector lights, height-adjustable driver's seat, LED tail lights and a front armrest. And you have a base variant that feels anything but basic. The Elevate's boxy, robust design ensures it stands out. A tall, flat bonnet and a straight roofline contribute to an imposing road presence, making sure all eyes are on you as you cruise past. Honda is raising the safety bar with the Elevate by integrating ADAS. Features such as auto emergency braking, lane keeping assist and adaptive cruise control are designed to keep you and the passengers safe on the road. Under the hood, the Elevate houses a 1.5-litre naturally aspirated petrol engine sourced from the Honda City. This tried and tested power plant delivers consistent performance and dependability. In contrast to the less proven small capacity turbocharged engines of its competitors. For those who prefer an automatic transmission, the Elevate offers a CVT option at an attractively modest premium of 1 lakh rupees over the manual version. Plus, this option is available across all variants except the base SV, providing flexibility for different budgets. Despite its many strengths, the Elevate misses out on some crucial features like a panoramic sunroof, front ventilated seats, tyre pressure monitoring system, powered driver's seat and a 360-degree parking camera. This could be a deal-breaker for some. When the base variants come well-equipped, some crucial safety features like side and curtain airbags, rear armrest and the full suit of ADAS are only available in the higher variants. The 1.5-litre naturally aspirated petrol engine, though reliable and powerful, doesn't quite match the torque and drivability offered by rivals with turbocharged engines. Those looking for a more spirited drive might find this a drawback. The Elevate is comfortable, easy to drive and will be a good companion in the long run. It won't excite you much, but it will not disappoint you either. So, now that you know both sides of the coin, would you consider the Honda Elevate? Tell us in the comment section below or connect with us on our social media handles to know more.